In this video tutorial, we're going to look at how to find the equation of a straight line. First of all, you need to understand that if you want to find the equation of a straight line, the equation will always look like y is equal to mx plus c. m is what we call the gradient, and c is the y-intercept. So if you had a graph, for instance, and you had a straight line, C would be where it crosses the y-axis, and M would be the gradient, the steepness of this line. So I'm going to show you how to find the gradient first, and then the y-intercept. So let's say uh, you're given two points on this line, and the points that you're given was A is 2, 3, and B is 6, 7. How would you use these two coordinates in order to find the equation of the line? Well, first I'm going to find the gradient. So to find the gradient, I need to do 6, 7. So basically, I take um, the largest coordinate possible, so in our case is B, but it doesn't really matter which way around you turn it. Uh, just to make our calculation easier, I take the biggest one, and then I'm gonna take away 2, 3. So you find the difference between the coordinates. So now I'm gonna do uh, the sums 7 take with 3 is 4, and 6 take with 2 is 4 as well. Now here is the tricky bit. What you need to understand is that whenever you've got coordinates, the first number is the x coordinates and the second one is the y coordinate. So in order to find the gradient and after you've performed this operation here, what you need to do is look at the answer that you got here and you need to divide the y coordinate by the x coordinate. So in our case it's going to be 4 divided by 4, which is equal to 1. So this means that the gradient of between the two points A and B is 1. So we found M. Next, we're going to look at how to find C. So, so far our equation looks like this. Y is equal to mx plus C. We know M is equal to 1. So now we can say that y is equal to 1x plus c. However, what we tend to do is we tend to not write the 1 because in algebra, if you don't have a number in front of the x, it means that it's 1. So we can write it as y is equal to x plus c. So our next job is to find how much c is equal to you see here. And what we can do in order to find it is either use the coordinate A, which was 2, 3, or the coordinate B, which was 6, 7. And substitute them into our equation. Now, I'm going to try to look for the easiest one, and in our case, it's a 2, 3. And we know that 2 is the x coordinate, and y is and 3 is the y coordinate. So I'm going to go ahead and replace the y here with the 3 and the x here with the 2. So I'm going to say that 3 is equal to 2 plus c. And now it's just a matter of solving this simple equation. And I can say that c is equal to 3 take away 2 because if I take that plus 2 to the other side, it becomes minus 2, the opposite operation, and 3 take with 2 is equal to 1. So in the end, we can say that my equation is y is equal to x plus c. We found that c was equal to 1, so it's x plus 1. And that's it. This is how you find the equation of a straight line between two points.